is SAP DMC and we'll have a quick look at what is a DMC and then we'll, we'll just check what, what are the features and capabilities that DMC is offering and what is its overview and uh, complete tool. Okay. So first thing. So DMC is a cloud-based manufacturing execution system. So it's a, a cloud-based linear system of near real-time data and analytics, which is built on top of uh, cloud, found, cloud Foundry and running on SAP BTP, Business Technology Platform. And D so DMC is going to enable you to run different manufacturing processes and analyze manufacturing and business data. Since it is deployed on cloud, it is going to decrease the implementation complexity so you can actually you know, access your software from any browser. Okay. So this cloud solution is actually adapted to both uh, discrete and process manufacturing industry. So you'll be able to manage your production orders and batch oriented process, process orders. Next one is the main highlight of the DMC is that you, know, you will have the possibility to improve your global visibility across all the plants by covering your top floor business systems to your shop floor equipment. And this is actually going to provide transparency all over production processes and will make you gain faster and more consistent insights. And finally, DMC is an integrated and extensible solution from the start. So you'll be able, so you'll be, you'll have uh, actually an end-to-end -end process visibility by integrating it into other SAP systems like you know, EWM, ME, MII, and uh, SAP Peak, like plant connectivity. Now you know. In DMC now they are moving with uh, you know moving on to next uh, you know advanced cloud tool that is production character and etc. Okay, so or you know even you can integrate this into, into third party systems as well and you can add different uh, custom plugins extensions and your own analytic and your own analytical models. For example, machine learning algorithms and custom application to design and fit DMC to your own needs. Okay. So also DMC allows manufacturers to execute manufacturing processes and also you know uh, analyze manufacturing and business data. It will integrate you know obviously it will integrate the different systems with cost effective and high quality and resource efficient method based on industry 4.0. Okay, going on further. So let's check what is DMC now. So within DMC we have two main modules. So as we can see here we have insights and we have execution. So on one hand, manufacturing execution is an MES running on the cloud. Okay, that will allow you to monitor and execute production operations down to the individual work center with an out-of-box integration to SAP ERP and S4 HANA systems. On the other hand, we have manufacturing insights that will help you gain real-time visibility by monitoring the performance of the production processes from an enterprise to plant level. And also you can track you can also track here the resources, people's missions to assess progress. Okay, for example, uh, the cost and the impact of driving new improvements in your process. So within these two main modules, we can also find resource orchestration. We have a module called resource orchestration. In short, we'll call it as Rio, SAP Rio. That's a part of DMC that will allow you to schedule and dispatch operations to appropriate work centers and resource to effectively utilize machines and labor resources on the shop floor. So basically Rio, uh, Rio is one module where you can do the scheduling part, scheduling and dispatch part, where you know you will have you know a work list of several work, work orders, and then you will you will be having a screen where you know it will display the all the available resources and work centers available. So we, we can discuss this part, you know, Rio part detail in SAP DMC uh, training. Okay. So for now, we'll just know we have a feasibility of uh, dispatching and scheduling the shop orders okay and then we have automation that will enable engineers to operate to control the machines without any human intervention okay we can see here manufacturing network that will run with the with this manufacturing network functionalities you will be able to extend your landscape and collaborate with different network partners like customer suppliers or you know original equipment manufacturers and other service providers and finally, we have Asset Central Foundation that enables to centrally manage your assets, information, and multiple in-house solutions and all over the business partners. So within this database, we will be able to find all the master data, transactional data as equipment templates or work orders. So as we can see, DMC is easily made communicate with SAP IoT for plant connectivity and machine automation as well as as for HANA for transactional master data.
coming to SAP DMC for execution. That is nothing but SAP DMC for E. Okay. So here you will orchestrate, control, and monitor the shop floor with central MES solution, intuitive user interface, and modern process oriented features such as the resource and order dispatch or graphical design of interlinked production processes are some of its core characteristics. Okay. <clears throat> so here you can see the main capabilities of DMC for execution. So you can see manufacturing execution on the top of you can see production operation dashboard, OEE, labor management and skills, and resource orchestration and dispatching, and machine and process orchestration, SAP ERP integration, plant connectivity, you know, data collection, quality and non conformance, uh, work in process tracking, and component assembly, work in instructions printing. So these are kind of you know, uh, main functions or main features of DMCE. So here you can see, you know, uh, we will be able to record the assembly of the components or the consumption of batches, we will be also able to view the work instructions and report non-conformance and alerts to collect production data. And the production operation dashboard is fully configurable and designed based on the each type of user. So we have a pod designer here, so which will help us to you know, design different types of pod based on user role or user type of pods Okay, that can be done in DMCE for execution, manufacturing execution. Okay. So coming to the next one. So SAP DMC for insights. So SAP DM for insights, DMI. Okay. SAP DMI, formerly known as you know, SAP Digital Manufacturing Cloud Insights. Now it's a DMI. Earlier it used to call it DMCI. Okay. Sharpens production insights from enterprise to plant level to foster continuous improvement in the industrial environments using sensor and response software from SAP. <coughs> You can gain a common understanding of the priority, cost, and impact of driving new and challenging improvements in standard processes and workflows. You can also track the processes, people, machines, you know, performing the work to assess the progress and manage the variations that arise from the changes to the processes. If there are any changes, you know, you will be able to you know, uh, uh, manage and assess the process and the changes from there. So SAP DMI delivers industry standard key performance indicators KPIs for you to standardize KPIs calculation across manufacturing plants. Uh, it will use out of box standard pre delivered manufacturing KPIs fed with ERP system, ME system and DMC, DM execution data. Okay. Gain real time visibility and monitor the performance of the production process from regional level through geographic mapping. Compare the performance between regions like you know, uh, once we develop any dashboard on the you know, on top of performance part, we can compare the performance between regions, different plants within the within the regions and between our work centers as well okay, and resources. You know, you will be able to get quick visibility of personalized KPIs in global insight to identify non-performing regions, countries and plants. Okay. So in DMC current latest, we can we have this uh, embedded SAC, embedded SAP Analytics Cloud as well. We can use that SAC, embedded SAC in DMC, so that we will be able to, you know, uh, using MDO objects in uh, DMC, we will be able to uh, build dashboards, different types of dashboards, and we can create different types of models that can be used for, you know, fetching the data and, you know, assessing the uh, performance levels you know, of the different plants and at plant level or work center level even at order level as well we have that feasibility so for that we need to configure or we need to enable the part of sac in embedded sac in dmc okay and coming to manufacturing digital networks sap manufacturing network so here we'll call it digital networks for insights okay the sap manufacturing network is a result of the sap efforts to collaborate between customers suppliers faster and also more efficient. So it is a platform for an efficient and secure communication where customers can connect to suppliers and original equipment manufacturers can connect with service providers. And this collaboration takes place in so-called you know, collaboration rooms where methods of uh, production design, optimized quality, inspection or pricing. For example, suppliers of 3D printing services, material providers or you know, uh, original equipment manufacturer OEM and uh, technical uh, certification companies. Key capabilities of ma manufacturing networks can be add design data, quality criteria, and manufacturing requirements to request for quotation discussions. Review network services, pro sorry, uh, review network service providers 
to determine potential partners. Support Production Part Approval Process PAP, PPAP. Okay. And coming to extend the capabilities through integration of SW partners. So for special IP protection needs and royalty scenarios. Use part analysis to identify parts suitable for 3D printing. So it takes the advantage of business process integration with SAP solutions like you know SAP Ariba or S4 HANA or different partner solutions and supplier systems, etc. So this is all about you know uh, a brief introduction about DMC tools. Okay, what are available and what are the features that are available in this uh, DMC? Okay, so in one uh, we'll go in depth how we are going to use this SAP DMC tool in execution and how we can integrate with different systems like SAP ME or SAP MII or plant connect uh, no, production connector or plant connectivity or S4 HANA systems or EWM systems like this. So how we are going to transact uh, fetch the master data and use the master data and fetch the transactional data in the system and how we are going to complete the process and you know how we are going to digitalize the you know <coughs> digitalize this data. And uh, that's all for uh, today's session for demo session. Please let me know if you have any questions. And uh, this will be the end of the session. Thank you.